Now, the global economy, though, may be heading to its worst performance since the 2009 financial crisis as the coronavirus outbreak increasingly douses hopes of a quick rebound. Bank of America expects global growth to come in at 2.8% this year. That's the slowest clip in a decade. That doesn't even take into consideration the possibility of a global pandemic that will shut down economic activities in other major cities. European and Korean central banks are resisting demands to cut rates, saying it's too soon to respond. Analysts are also on the fence on how lower rates will spur activity if su supply chains are already broken. But economists and investors predict that major central banks will eventually loosen policy. Standard Chartered expects the Fed to slash benchmark rates in April and June. Investors are also anticipating the release of China's PMI over the weekend. A Bloomberg survey puts the consensus at 45. That's the lowest since 2008. A reading of below 50 indicates a contraction in manufacturing activities. Thank you.